All right, guys, today we have my Caribbean. It's a Mustang. It's a 4.9 meter. So it's a 15 footer. As you can see there, uh, we've got a, got a 125 horsepower Mercury on it. So it's an inline six, triple carb, two stroke. Uh, it's a vintage. I take it, it's from a 69. So it's either a 68 or a 69 model. I, I understand that the boat is around about that time as well. So it's got a powerful, powerful motor. I've just done the water pump on it, um, fixed up the carburetors. It's a serial number just there. It's been manufactured here in Victoria, Scoresby. It's, uh, it's made for six adults, maximum capacity of, of about 120 horsepower, so we've got a bit more than that. It's got the uh, clearance lights on it for, for um, if, if you want to do any night fishing or early morning. It's missing that top lens there, as you can see. These, uh, it's a speedometer and everything else for this X25. It's a Lawrence. It's been been left out in the sun for a little while. I haven't tested it, so I'm not sure if this unit is working. But uh, all the wiring and everything in the bracket is there up on the dashboard, so you see that there. It's got the swivel base seats. Uh, they, they're, they're, they're from BCF, they're pretty good. New carpet, um, was in about a year and a half ago, I was told. Got everything there, as you can see, paddles. Um, fire extinguisher, rope, that's the original fuel tank out of it, it's a 21 litre. Done new wheel bearings, it's got the, the uh, bearing buddies in there as well. Um, so the bearings are brand new, that's a spare. And bearing, the bearings haven't touched the water yet, so I've, I've just recently changed them. The boat's garaged as you can see, and this is where I did all the work on it. And uh, trailers registered, boats registered. This was a maiden voyage, so the trailer's in, in pretty good nick. It's got, got a bit of life left in it. We uh, actually start her up and I'll just take my, my two year old son for a little bit of a cruise around, uh, around the water. So you hear it going quite well. The reverse has been repaired. Uh, the, the, um, the lock of the reverse uh, mechanism wasn't working, so it's all been repaired and it's all lubricated and everything's adjusted accordingly to specifications so it's all good. You see in this in this video here we've got a bimini. So it's got the bimini there, how I've tied it to the front. Got those homemade fenders in there too, so that's that's part of the sale. But um, this particular day was about uh, was just as we left the jetty it was about 10 to 15 knots. And um, my wife just asked if we could turn around, so I thought I'd do a bit of uh, video on, on the maiden voyage. So it uh, went well. Then afterwards, I went out on my own and um, then I went out with my brother, which you'll see in a moment. But um, the motor runs really well, it's a two stroke. Um, it um, again, it idles really well, reverse gears are working fine, smoothly in the remote control. So that's all been lubricated. I've just um, I've just serviced the steering cable. The steering cable's working fine now. My, my two-year-old son can actually uh, turn the steering quite easily, so it's uh, it's freed up. Um, I've polished the, as you can see in this image, is coming up here. Of, um, I've polished the windscreen, so the windscreen's all been all done up and it's all all cleaned. As you can see, the, the boat's looking spick and span. So this boat is ready to go. All you have to do is just fill her up with fuel and and uh, and you need tow vehicle, of course. So we took it out on the open water. This was a long weekend, labor weekend. And we're doing about 20 to 25 knots here at the moment. Um, the, the, we actually had a headwind, so um, it was about 10 to 15 knots. We couldn't quite open the throttle completely because it was a little bit dangerous. So, uh, so um, I'm sure if you if you wanted to, you could open up a little bit more. But um, we've got a jet ski here following us. Jet ski itself is sitting in our wash, so he's um, he's cruising behind us. That water. See here, we've got uh, 25 knots, and I've I've personally taken this thing up to 35. And, and it still had a bit more in it, and, and um, it was about five to ten knots that day. So, you know, the guys, this is the boat. If you've got any questions, please give us a call. But it's uh, the boat's ready to go. It's fully registered. Trailer's registered. 
and all you really need to do is just put some fuel in it. You obviously need your marine license and you can start fishing, skiing. If you want to tow a, um, a tube, a banana boat, it's all good. Alright guys, any questions, give us a buzz. Thank you.